Hello everyone, my name is Droogie Forever, and today I thought for Silent Hill 2's 20th anniversary, which I'm just going to miss on the channel probably by a little bit, um, I thought we would thought we'd play the game. Um, so yeah, yeah, let's play through the game and see, uh, see how well I remember my favorite game of all time, because it's been a while. I love this scene. I love a lot of the cutscenes in this game. They're so well done. God, this game needs to be re-released so fucking bad, man. Or remake, remaster something, anything. I don't care what. Do something with it, Konami. What are you doing? It's just nuts. I love the music. I love the look of it. It's just such a good game. I love these uncanny valley style camera angles. Love the stories, you know, of An Angela and, you know, James and Eddie. It's just uh, such a good game. So yeah, so September 24th of 2001, uh, Silent Hill 2 released in North America for the PlayStation 2. My restless dreams. I see that. It released later on in other territories um, and then on other platforms, of course. Promised you'd take me there again someday. But it released first in America and I guess Canada um, wow. 20 years ago today. I'm... I'm it's 11.32 p.m., so I have 28 minutes, so I'm, I'm going to be playing it past the 24th, but still. And then I'll get it up on the channel as fast as I can. Um, I was out of town today, which is why it didn't happen sooner. Uh, but I got back in town, and now I'm going to do this. The name on the envelope said... Mary. Mary. My wife's name. It's ridiculous. Couldn't possibly be true. That's what I keep telling myself. A dead person can't write a letter. Mary died of that damn disease three years ago. So then, why am I looking for her? she mean? This whole town was our special place. Does she mean the park on the lake? We spent the whole day there. Just the two of us staring at the water. Could Mary really be there? Is she really alive? Waiting for me. I don't know, James. We'll have to find out. All right, I'm gonna skip the map because um, I hopefully shouldn't need it. I like how in this version the uh, the mile marker is like uh, it's pretty far, but in the HD collection it's like not very far at all. Oh, I still have my buttons mapped. Cool. Okay. So that's quick save, so I can refresh my stamina. Oh, right, I do need to, the map to get through that. Um, oh, shit, I accidentally quick saved through that, and now, my, now, now he's being weird. Oh, shit. Hopefully it stops when I get... I might have to restart. Ah, oh, I quick saved through it, now I can't get through. All right, what if I... Can I get any text to come up? Where's my map button? Um, I can't get anything to work except this quick save. Fuck. Where's my map button? Come on. Oh, no. No, I'm not going to be able to get through. I screwed up. Fucking hell. You got to be kidding me. If you do that, if you quick save during text sometimes, the game just totally fucking dies, and I accidentally did it. God damn it. 
Yes, I, no, oh, come on. Oh, go back to safe graphic options. Come on. Oh, this game. This is why we need it fucking re-released. Why do I have two SH2 PCs now on my fucking... Oh, God. Please don't crash. All right. Let me make sure it fucking... God damn it, man. This is why we absolutely have to get this game on newer platforms. It, it runs like dog shit, man. May as well. All right, let's see if it saved it. Okay. Yes. All right, and always run is on, I think. Let's make sure. Zoom, run, yeah. All right. We'll skip through the cutscenes this time since it decided to be a fucking dick and crash on me. Of course, since I'm doing a fucking special 20th anniversary thing, of course it's gonna fucking screw with me. Oh, shit. Oh, I might turn the noise effect off. I don't like that. Uh, I don't know. I might, I've might. i never played with it on before. Maybe I'll just leave it. Not, on, not since PS2 days, you know. Um, maybe I'll just leave it. Because I didn't like the noise effect on the PS2, so I never use it on the PC version, but maybe I'll leave it on for a little bit. We'll see. See what it looks like. It's definitely harder to see with it. Um, yeah, I don't like it. I don't like it. I gotta say, I don't like the noise effect. I, I don't like it. Turn that off. Yes, change settings. There we go. That looks so much cleaner. That looks so much better. All right. And my quick save will, as long as I don't screw up this time, allow us to keep our stamina going. Since I'm playing on the PC version, all you gotta do is quick save every now and again and his stamina replenishes. I love this scene with Angela in the graveyard. I like all the scenes with Angela. She's very compelling in this. Because she acts so different in all of her scenes. And you're like, what the hell is going on with her? It takes you a little while to figure it out. And you've got to kind of read stuff around the town to piece it all together. And articles and stuff. But she's, um, she's such a strange character. Her behavior, you know. I love this this scene here almost has like a like a David Lynch feel to it. I love it. Yeah. I'm looking for Silent Hill. Is this the right way? Um yeah. It's hard to see with this fog, but there's only the one road. You can't miss it. Thanks. But Yes. I think you'd better stay away. This, uh, th this town, there's something wrong with it. It's kind of hard to explain, but... Is it dangerous? Maybe. And it's not just the fog, either. Okay, it's... I got it. I'll be careful. I'm not lying. No, I believe you. It's just, I guess I really don't care it's dangerous or not. I'm going to town either way. But why? I'm looking for someone. Oh, who, who is it? Someone 
very important to Every me. time he starts to think about his wife, he puts he puts his uh, hand on his head. It's such an interesting uh, such an interesting thing, you know. I love that like ethereal type music in that scene and then you know the conversation it's uh, it's so weird I don't know, I just I love this fucking game man it's so good favorite game of all time Silent Hill 2 and I own like fucking 18 copies of this fucking game too especially if you count you know, all the demos that I have. I have, I think I have four or five demos. I've got a bunch of copies of the HD collection, of course, but I have four copies of the PC version. I have the small box US version, big box US version. I have two of the European director's cuts. Um, and then I have, I don't know how many copies on PS2, a good many, because I have the south korean version i have the uh, at least two japanese ones uh the one with the red squares and then the saigo no udo one and then i think i think there's two of the saigo no udo ones uh two different versions of it so i think i think i've got those so i got at least three japanese ones i guess and then i have the north american one and then I have the North American Greatest Hits. And then I have the PAL two-disc set. Then I have a promo copy of the PAL two-disc set uh, from a uh, different European country. Um, God, I have so many. I've got... Um, I have the Japanese version for Xbox. I have the PAL version for Xbox, I think. I've got two or three of the North American ones because I've got the regular... And then at least two copies of the Platinum Hits. I have a ton of them. I mean, I have an absolute ton of copies of this game. It's nuts. Oh, man, I forgot to hold the uh, the text. I guess we're going to have to go fight the dude. Hmm. It really would help me to not have to do that. But you know what? At this point, it might be quicker to just go get the thing. I don't want to have to run all the way back. Because there's no text here. And if I bring up my, yeah, um, is there, where's my map? I forget what button the map is. Oh, okay, yeah, because I, I got the map, so now he won't say there's no map. Alright, never mind. Doesn't matter, we'll go get the plank, I guess. That's fine. I'll skip this scene, because it's not, uh, super important. You just kind of see a monster in the distance. It's, uh, you know, it is your first encounter with an enemy, but it's not, like, you know, super important or anything. It's not as, uh, as important as the other cutscenes, in my opinion. Yeah, no, there's a drink. If you're trying to speedrun this without the PC version, jump in here and then jump out real quick. That'll replenish your stamina. All right, we'll skip that. Uh, I don't remember how to... <laughs> All right. I figure we skip those because they're not super important either. I will watch, like, you know, the pyramid head scenes and Angela and Eddie and stuff like that. The enemy scene right here wasn't super important. Um, so we're going we're gonna to skip through that.
More health drinks. I don't stop and get hardly anything. Not anymore. I used to. Yeah, it's, it, this isn't a full-on speedrun or anything, but I am going to go through it fairly quickly since you guys have seen me play this before a bunch and speedrun it a ton. I mean, that's, that's how my channel started. I literally started... The only thing I did on my channel for, like, the first two months, I think, was speedrun Silent Hill 2. That was it. That was all my channel was dedicated to, was speedrunning Silent Hill 2. And then eventually I started being like, well, you know, I need more content in between the Silent Hill 2 speedruns. So that's when I started doing some regular gameplay. But I still wasn't speedrunning other games. Silent Hill 2 was the only thing I was speedrunning. Um, I did... Oh, let me get the map real quick. Just in case I get lost. Um... But over time, of course, that's grown into... Now I've done, I don't know, 85 games. I've learned speedruns for like 85 games or something like that. Um, I do more, way more non-speedruns than speedruns. Uh, so the channel, you know, has grown. And I mean, the Silent Hill 2 stuff got me, you know, I don't know... Uh, Um, you know, uh, 50 subscribers or something, but then people started kind of not liking speedruns because that's all I was doing was just this one game. And so it kind of became a thing where that was starting to hurt the channel a little bit. So I got up to, I don't know, 20 to 50 subscribers or something like that and started uh, adding other stuff. Uh, do I have the gun? Where's the gun? Oops, that's the map. Okay, I couldn't remember what key I had mapped stuff to. Um, so over time, I've, I've like gone away from Silent Hill 2 a bit. But it's still my favorite game. And it always will be. I did skip the scene with Laura just now. Because Laura's a little bitch. So I don't want to get angry already. She pisses me off. So. I could have tried to skip that, but I didn't want to get stuck again like before. Although now that we have the gun, we can aim to get out of that kind of stuff. Here's our buddy. The red pyramid thing. The executioner. Pyramid head himself. Ooh, what we got here? That's James. That's his character model. Yeah, James's character model. It's kind of interesting that they use him for that. I may not remember the whole run. It's been a while, but a lot of this is muscle memory at this point because I've done it so many times. But if I forget anything, it's just going to be because, you know... Muscle memory caused me to forget it. Whoa. What are you doing, James? Notice... Oh, okay, never mind. I thought I thought the body moves for some reason, but I guess not. Oh, I gotta check the time. Let's see. Okay, I need to open my inventory and I don't remember what button it is. Here we go. Okay, whoops, wrong way. The solution's always the same, but the starting point is random. Solutions always nine ten. I 
should probably start picking up bullets soon. I guess I can get... Although we're playing on super easy, so I shouldn't really need them, but... I can grab some, I guess. Move. Don't be a jerk. See, if I was speedrunning, I would have reset right there. I would have reset at the clock, really, but... Die, die, die. Start shooting. Start shooting now, James. Shoot him. I like how he didn't, like, hurt any of the wood. Also, if you notice in that scene, that's your clue to pick up the key. Because you don't know there's a key in there, right? If you just go, you don't know there's a key in that place you were just standing. But in the cutscene, you could see the key. So that's your clue to pick up the key. Oh, wait. I'm going the wrong way. Muscle memory's failing me again. That's the key that Laura kicked away from us. camera was keeping up with us pretty good. I wonder if I still have some of the Enhanced Edition stuff installed. I thought I uninstalled it, but maybe I didn't. That camera seemed to keep up with us a lot better than it should have. So I'll have to see here shortly. We'll find out. There's a cutscene I can use to determine whether or not I... Um, whether or not I, I have the Enhanced Edition installed. Alright, uh, yeah. Now outside, we get to read a little bit about our buddy, Walter Sullivan, from Silent Hill 4. So here we go, let's see. We got the old man coin. The police announced today that Walter Sullivan, who was arrested on the 18th of this month for the brutal murder of Billy Locaine and his sister Miriam, committed suicide in his jail cell early on the morning of the 22nd. According to the police statement, Sullivan used a soup spoon to stab himself in the neck, severing his carotid artery. By the time the guard discovered him, Sullivan was dead from blood loss, the spoon buried two inches in his neck. An old schoolmate of Walter Sullivan's from his hometown of Pleasant River said he didn't look like the type of guy who would kill kids. But I do remember that just before they arrested him, he was blurting out all sorts of strange stuff like, He's trying to kill me. He's trying to punish me. The monster. The red devil. Forgive me, I did it, but it wasn't me. The schoolmate then added, I guess now that I think of it, he was kind of crazy.
You know, reading that makes me realize if Walter Sullivan saw Pyramid Head, although, you know, maybe it wasn't exactly Pyramid Head, but if Walter saw P Pyramid Head, then it wasn't just James. Pyramid Head wasn't just for James. You know? Which is what everybody always thought. Um, it's what Sil Silent Hill purists think, for sure. That, uh, that Pyramid Head should only be in the second game because he's there for James, to punish James. But reading that, I mean, you kind of think that, uh, that he showed up for Walter Sullivan as well, so I don't know. <clears throat> blue, 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 blah. Blue, 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 blah, blah. blah, 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 blah. <laughs> isn't too safe either. What happened here anyway? Uh, I, I told you, I don't know. I'm not even from this town. I just, I just... <sighs> you too, huh? Something just brought you here. You better get out of here soon. Well, yeah, you're right. What about you? I'll leave as soon as I'm done here. Eddie, be careful. James, I, I, um, you be careful too. Who <laughs> blah 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 blah. realize do I have the key to get out of here I do okay I love this camera angle they do such a good job with the camera angles in this game like it's it's amazing you don't see any other game with camera angles like this Right, the safe. I don't need that. I don't need that. All right. I do not remember which way to go here. Um, I think I need to go here. And then let's grab this just in case I get lost. Okay. And then we go down here. And then this way, I think. And then we go in here. And then there's some bullets, and then I think we see Angela again. Love this song. Oh, yeah. Do 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 do. And 
Angela. Angela, okay. I don't know what you're planning, but there's always another way. Really? She has a much different attitude this time from when we saw her last. But you're the same as me. It's easier just to run. Besides, is what we deserve. No, I'm not like you. Are you afraid? I... Uh, I'm sorry. It's okay. Did you find your mother? Not yet. She's not anywhere. Did she live in this apartment building? I don't know. So, all you know is she lived in this town. What did you say? <laughs> Look at that with the mirror, man. They, you know they were that? so good with these well, camera angles. I just figured, because this is where you're looking for her. How else would I know? Yeah. Am I right? I'm so tired. So, why did you come to this town anyway? I... I'm sorry. Did... did you find the person you're looking for? Not yet. Her name's Mary. She's my wife. I'm sorry. It's okay. Anyway, she's dead. I don't know why I think she's here. She's dead? Don't worry. I'm not crazy. <laughs> At least, I don't think so. Uh, I've got to find my mama. Should I go with you? This town's dangerous. Now I know what you meant back there in the cemetery. I'll be okay by myself. Besides, I'd just slow you down. What about that? Will you hold it for me? Sure. No problem. If I kept it, I'm not sure what I might do. See, you can see the coin. That's your clue to take the coin. You know, you can see it in the cutscene. I, I just love the little touches. They they have so many things in this game that are just like, I don't know. It's just great. So he took the knife, and now there's the coin. So you got to pick that up. God, I just realized I don't remember the solution to the puzzle. Also, do I even have the coins? How many do I got? Okay, I do have them. No, 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 no. Get out of the screen. Alright, let me read the thing. I don't remember the solution. Something written on the desk. To the right is the lady, to the left is the old one, and the center crawls the other. Okay, so right is the lady, left old one, center snake. Okay, right lady. Okay. Okay. Center snake. And then the old dude on the left, I'm assuming. Got Lynn house key. Oops, wrong way. I'm going to get hit by bugs. Go. Whoa, 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 whoa. Go this way. 
And then is it left? I think it's left. Yeah, I think it's this house. Man, so far so good. I'm remembering stuff. I'll grab those. I don't need them, but I'll take them. go. I was trying to wait so that he wouldn't want to hit me, but he decided to hit me anyway. I just wanted to see what would happen. The water didn't even turn red. This game sucks. It's not good. He didn't even bleed in the water. Even though it was made 20 years ago. I need my games to be better. Sucky game, sucky game. Alright, here's where we're going to find out whether this is the enhanced edition or not. And it is. Because he's in the cutscene to the left, and you're not supposed to be able to see him. So, I'm going to have to uh, uninstall and reinstall again from scratch. I don't know. Maybe I did. What's a little girl like you doing here, anyway? Huh? Are you blind or something? What's that letter? Well, I don't have everything, because... Some of the stuff isn't cleaned up, so I must have deleted some of it, but not all of it. Love Mary anyway. Wait, how do you know Mary's name? I also love how the cutscenes look like the game, and then sometimes the cutscene ends and you don't even know you're in the game because of that. So, like the uh, the one where he's. Um, the one where he's staring at the mirror at the beginning, you know, or this one right there. If I hadn't started moving immediately, it's hard to tell sometimes when the cutscene ends. It's kind of cool. I like that. Mary? No, you're not. Do I look like your girlfriend? No, my late wife. Just your hair and clothes are different. My name is Maria. I don't look like a uh, ghost, do I? See? Funny sentence if you play Born from a Wish. Place, huh? 
I'll bet it was. Huh? <laughs> Don't get so mad. I was just joking. Anyway, it's not that way. It's this way. You're coming with me? You were gonna just leave me? No, but... With all these monsters around? No, I just... I'm all alone here, and everyone else is gone. I look like Mary, don't I? You loved her, right? <laughs> or maybe... You hated her. Don't be ridiculous. So it's okay? Yeah, fine. God, I love this game. God, that why why does Konami hate this game so much? Uh they don't hate it enough to not make tons of money off of it though. They put out a new poster today, it was thirty bucks. Um they put out a t shirt that was thirty something, I think, or forty bucks. They put out, um, they did a collaboration with this other website and they put out a watch that was $218. They put out a wallet that was a hundred and something, a backpack that was 200 and something. I think a jacket that was 200 and something. Uh, so they seem perfectly capable of milking it, milking the fans for all they're worth except when it comes to actually doing anything with the games they don't seem to want to do anything with the games so the official silent hill twitter account did not even mention the anniversary today which is like a big fuck you to the fans like they just i don't know what's going on man konami sucks so fucking bad so what'd you do Robbery? Murder? Nah, nothing like that. Huh, you're just a gutless bat, though. What'd you have to say that for? I thought you said the cops were out for you. No, I just ran because I was scared. I don't know what the cops are doing. But if you did something bad, why don't you just say you were sorry? No good. They wouldn't listen. Nobody will ever forgive me. Did you find the lake you're looking for? What's your name, Mary? James, we met in the apartment building? Yeah, I remember, but... Are you alone here, Eddie? Um, no. Bye-bye. <laughs> How can you sit there and eat pizza? Aren't you going to go after her? 
she went through there. Is there any other way? Yeah, there is. Right through there. Let's do it. It's no good. It's locked. Okay, um, there we go. <laughs> I couldn't remember which way to go there. Liquor bottles, I don't need that right now. It's not that I don't drink, in fact, I drink a fair bit to get away from the pain, the loneliness, but the drinking never changes anything. Anyway, I don't need it now, there's something I have to do. Yeah, it kind of implies James has been drinking a lot since the uh, incident at Raccoon City. No, I'm kidding. You know what incident I mean. If you've played this game before, you're very familiar with the incident. The incident. All I can see now is Marvin talking to Leon and then being like, Just go! Over there! Foggy doors, foggy doors, do whatever foggy doors do. Foggy doors does, foggy doors do. Nothing inside. Alright, let's see what we got here. The potential for this illness exists in all people, and under the right circumstances, any man or woman would be driven, like him, to the other side. The other side, perhaps, may not be the best way to phrase it. After all, there is no wall between here and there. It lies on the borders where reality and unreality intersect. It is a place both close and distant. Some say it isn't even an illness. I cannot agree with them. I am a doctor, not a philosopher, or even a psychiatrist. But sometimes I have to ask myself this question. It's true that to us his imaginings are nothing but the inventions of a busy mind. But to him, there simply is no other reality. Furthermore, he is happy there. So why, I ask myself, why, in the name of healing him, must we drag him painfully into the world of our own reality? I got the key from Joseph. It's probably the key to that box. Thanks. I got the purple bull key. Bull. <laughs> I got the bull, baby. Got the only sweetest thing in the world. Got the bull. You got the bull, bull, bull. The only sweetest thing in the world. I don't remember where to go from here. We can skip this. Get the bent needle. Take the shotgun. I got the bull, baby. Examination room key. I don't think I actually need that, but I'm gonna take it. All right, let's see. <clears throat> A sheet of carbon paper. I know it. I know the number of the box. Four, seven, three, three, it can't help him anymore. The button key doesn't scare me, so nobody can stop who I am. I don't know who I am, is who I am, is who I am, is... Four, seven, three, three. Okay, thanks, James.
All right, which door do we leave her in? Not this one. Okay, is that all I needed on this floor? I honestly don't remember. It's been a while. I don't remember the code. Oh, is that it? Dude, that was total memory. Muscle memory. For sure. Alright, uh, she goes in S3, I think. Yeah. I'm tired and sick. I'm just going to lay here on this filthiest mattress ever in existence. <laughs> Off those pills down. There we go. You should rest. It could be non existence creeping in. So comfy. I would. Not want to lay there. As soon as I, can. I don't think that's a good idea. Look, the cutscene ended and you couldn't even tell. It looked just like the regular scene. Shit, I just realized. What was that code? Was it 4733? I don't even remember. Fuck me. I think it was 4733. Diary. Rain. Stared out the window all day. Peaceful here. Nothing to do. Still not allowed to go outside. Still raining. Talked with the doctor a little. Would they have saved me if I didn't have a family to feed? I know I'm pathetic. Weak. Not everyone can be strong. Rain again. The meds made me feel sick today. If I'm only better when I'm drugged, then who am I anyway? Rain as usual. I don't want to cause any more trouble for anyone, but I'm a bother either way. Can it really be such a sin to run instead of fight? Some people may say so, but they don't have to live in my shoes. It may be selfish, but it's what I want. It's too hard like this. It's just too hard. It's clear outside. The doctors told me I've been released, that I've got to go home. I... Whoosh! Thank you, menacing pyramid thing. Alright, uh, I don't remember. Okay, that's reload. One of these is heal. Not up. That's the map. That's the map. Get out of that. Okay. Found it. Alright. Uh, oh. What's that note say? Something's written on the wall. If Joseph looks calm, he can be taken out of his cell. Oh my god. I can't even read that. Um, Alright. Hold on. Let me write the first one down. I think it was 4733. Four seven three three. This one looks like I don't even know. It looks kind of like a four, and then either nine or three, and then a five, and then a nine. Oh my God! These these are the worst. I've never seen one that looked this bad before. All right, we'll we'll try to figure it out. That's like the worst looking number I've ever seen on this game. I'm trying to remember where I need to go here. She's in S3. So I can check on her. I'll be okay soon. Did you find Laura?
Okay. All right. One of these was like 4733. Yeah. All right. So now we got to figure this one out. All right. I think it's a four. And then I think maybe a three. And then a five. And then a nine. Okay. Let's try a nine there. Oh boy. Whoops. Um, this is going to be fun. Because it probably means the first number is wrong. So I wonder what that could be instead of a four. That couldn't be a five, could it? Because this one was a five. Oh, it was. Holy shit. It was a five. Jesus. All right. That's nuts. Ah, shit. Hold on. Uh, I hope this works. I can't believe that was a five. <clears throat> Got the elevator key. Nice. All right. I don't remember where to go on the elevator, but we shall go. I don't remember what floors to go to here. Uh, I'm on three. I guess I can go to two. Do I have the basement key? Hold on. Examination room key. Shit. Uh, was there a door I needed in here? I don't even remember, man. I have no idea where I need to go. It's one of these doors. No, it can't be this. Can it? No. Five, M4, M3. Nope. I have no idea. Maybe I just need the first floor. I don't remember. Oh, I need to find Laura, I think, right? Is this where I find Laura? Yeah. Yeah, okay, I remember what I'm doing now. All right. Wait, no, she's not in here. Oh, here we go. I went the wrong door.
This is no place for a kid. There are all sorts of strange things around here. I can't believe you haven't even gotten a scratch on you. Why should I? Wait, wait. There's something I gotta get. Later, okay? But it's really important. What is it? A letter from Mary. Huh? I wanna go get it. Is that okay? Yes, yes. See, you can tell it the like he's not moving on the left because you're not supposed to be able to see that and she wasn't moving in this scene earlier because you weren't supposed to see that so yeah i need to uninstall and reinstall again yeah in the back do a fresh install from scratch i have some of my saves backed up so it's fine what are you doing laura it's further back in the desk Open the door, Laura. Why should I? I'm a liar, right? Sort of. Want me to open it? Huh? Huh? Do ya? What's the magic word? Laura? Okay. I guess it won't open it. I think I'll just leave you at this. You snotty little brat! Is this still alive? One shot should have killed that. Okay, I think we're okay. I don't know why it's taking them so long to get into place. That's super weird. I think I need to go to three first. Is it this one? I don't know. Maybe it's not. Damn it, James. Stop trying to lock onto them. Maybe this is where I need to go to the basement. I don't freaking know. I don't know if I have the key though. Yeah, I don't have the basement key. Shit. See, I'm rem I'm not remembering things that I need to remember. Maybe I needed to go to two first. Wait. Wait, where the hell am I going? I need... There definitely wasn't a door past her that I needed, right? What am I doing? Oh, damn it. Hold on. Hmm. 
No, I don't need this yet. Uh, definitely don't need that. Okay. Dude, James, come on. Okay, this I definitely need. I got the dry cell battery and the basement storeroom key. Okay, so that's where I get the basement key. All right, now we need to go to the basement. So now we go to three. So it's two, then three, okay. I completely messed up the order here. I keep picking up shells I don't need anymore. James. Mary? Oh, Maria. It's you. I thought you were... Sorry. Anyway, I'm glad you're alive. <laughs> anyway... anyway. What do you, what do you mean, mean anyway? You don't sound very happy to see me. I was almost killed back there. Why didn't you try to save me? All you care about is that dead wife of yours. I've never been so scared in my whole life. You couldn't care less about me, could you? No, I just... Don't stay with me. Don't ever leave me alone. You're supposed to take care of me. <laughs> so, what about Laura? Did you find her? Yeah, but she ran away. We've got to find her. You really seem to care about her. Do you know her? I've never met her before. <laughs> I just feel sorry for her. She's all alone. And for some reason, I feel like it's up to me to protect her. I always hit the wrong angle for that ring, even during speed running. I used to hit that angle wrong every time. Uh, this is where you get the crazy questions, but we're not going to answer those. It takes so long. It's like 10 minutes. It's so long. Um, but if you want, you can listen to them. And when you figure out the answer, go to uh, um, the floor we were just on before this one. In the room next to the stairwell. And... Uh, you put in the answers and it'll give you a bunch of stuff. Lots of health and bullets. Definitely helpful if you play on like harder difficulties. What's this? Not very cute, is it? You, James. You take it. Mm, thanks. It's got the lead ring. Copper ring, lead ring, lead ring, copper ring, copper ring, lead ring. Yes, yeah, so go to the third floor by this stairwell if you want to answer the questions in the elevator. There's a door over there.
I always have trouble with this stairwell when I'm speed running too. There's a note on the ground. Let's see. I took the director's key, the one to the museum. I hid it behind the praying woman. When I went out for the day trip, I picked it up, but I did not steal it. I'm not a criminal. I like how it's spelled like horrible. Horrible spelling from the prisoner. Is he a prisoner? Mental patient? Patient? Is this a hospital? This is a hospital, yeah. So, patient. Sounds like Maria's getting beat up. You're supposed to protect me. He who is not bold enough to be stared at from across the abyss is not bold enough to stare into it himself. The truth can only be learned by marching forward. Follow the map. There's a letter and a wrench. Hospital lobby key. See, so you're not supposed to see her stop on the right there. There's so many things you're not supposed to see here. <laughs> Damn it. Marie's dead. I couldn't protect her. Once again, I couldn't do anything to help. Laura's run off somewhere. Mary, what, what should I do? Are you really waiting somewhere for me? Or is this your way of taking? I'm going to find Mary. It's the only thing I have left to hope for. Mary, could you really be in this town? Could you really be in this town? You know, I've never looked around this parking lot, I don't think. What's in here? Anything? Nah. I walk by it all the time and I never go in there. Just curious.
I wonder what's in here right now. There's no bug spray, is there? Is there any spray? Hyper spray? Bar Neely's. I don't see any spray. I don't think there's any spray in here. Maybe you have to get it. I think you have to get it at the beginning of the game. I don't need this, but I'll grab it. I don't need any of this stuff. I don't need anything. I don't know why I'm picking anything up. I have everything. I've had everything I've need I'll need for the rest of the game for like forever now. I don't need any of this. <laughs> I was randomly picking shit up for no reason. It's like a thing you do in games, you know? You see stuff, you pick it up. Perhaps you're a fool. The truth usually betrays people. Part of that abyss is in the old society. The key to this society is in the park at the foot of the praying woman, inside of the ground, inside of a box. To open it, I need a wrench. My patient buried it there. I knew, but did nothing. It made me uneasy to have such a thing near. I wasn't looking for the truth. I was looking for a tranquility. I also saw that thing. I fled. But the museum was sealed as well. Now no one dares to approach that place. If you still do not wish to stop, James, I pray to the Lord to have mercy on your eternal soul. Lord, have mercy on my soul. Lord, 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 have mercy, James. Have mercy. Mercy. Boom, 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 Pretty woman. Walking down the street. Pretty woman. With your green jacket looking fleek. Pretty woman. I've got a pipe and a shotgun. And a pistol just for fun. Boom, 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 boom. The door that wakes in darkness, opening into nightmares. If you saw that next to a door and you were already in a nightmarish world, would you open the door? Did I pass the... Wait a minute. I did. I don't even know how I did that. Yes, I will dig. Thank you. We can skip this stuff. Not a big deal. Bum 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 bum. I will get a copyright strike. Ba -da -ba -da. Copyright strike. Ba -da -ba -da.
Can't remember if that's the last one or if there's... Yeah, there's one more. Trumpeting his arrival. Long way down. Really good song from the Evil Within soundtrack. If you've never uh, never heard it. Long way down. Check it out. It's like the only song, like the actual, the only actual song song on the soundtrack. The rest is all like ambient sound and background music. But Long Way Down, you can also hear it at the title screen, like right when you first play the game, get to the end of the first part of chapter one, it plays that song as the credits roll up at the beginning. It's a very good song. That one that's like, starts off like, uh, find myself within darkness twisting me around. It's really good. Um, let's see here. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Is there anything I need laying here? I don't think so. There is a health kit, but there's nothing like important, right? Okay, yeah. Oh, you know what? I am gonna need this. Yeah. Jump on down, James. James, my boy. We're traveling through some deep, dark holes. When you see a deep, dark, wet hole, you just got to go for it, man. Jump right on in. All right, let's see. It's over here somewhere. Nope. Right here? There it is. I knew it was by one of the white bricks, but I couldn't remember where. We'll do the bug room, it's fine. I don't usually do this part, but... Oh, uh, yeah, okay, that's fine. Uh, I want this. I don't usually do this part, but... We'll do it. Alright. Should be 747 then. Wait, what? Okay. There we go. Not bad. Usually when you get two, it's easy, but I guess uh, I'm just an idiot. Another deep, dark hole. Go for it. This one's so deep, so dark. wonder how good the batteries are in that thing that it, I mean yeah they gave out there but like they lasted them like you know a good long while most video game batteries die in seconds especially if they're energizer and it's Alan Wake <clears throat> ain't no big deal. Eddie's lost it gun to their head. you you killed him but it wasn't my fault. He made me do it. Calm down, Eddie. Tell me what happened. That guy, he, he had it coming. I didn't do anything. He just came after me. Besides, he was making fun of me with his eyes, like that other one. Just for that, you killed him? What do you mean, just for that? Eddie, you can't just kill someone because of the way they looked at you. Oh yeah? Why not? Till now I always let people walk all over me. Just like that stupid dog. He had it coming too. Eddie? <laughs> I was just joking, James. He was dead when I got here. Honest. Anyway, I gotta run. 
You're going out there alone? Yeah. Eddie? The fuck, Eddie? Wait, isn't there a... No, not that. There we go. Tablet of the Gluttonous Pig. Alright, I do not remember which direction to go here. Okay, I guess it's up. And then we go in here. No, no, no. Nope. This isn't it. I think it's up a little further. I think we need in here. Yeah, this looks familiar. Move. And then is it up or down? I think it's down. I think I'm supposed to go down and across. I think. Oh. There we go. And then up to... hold on. I only have two tablets, so I can't go outside yet. So... I think I go through here, and then I find one of these. And then I grab that, and then we go out. Okay. And then we go back, I think. And then we go down, and he'll be in my way. Because he always is, because he's a douchebag. Then the camera always goes wonky here for no reason. Uh -oh. You can't just kill someone because of the way they looked at you. Wait, what? Oh, I need the lighter. Shit. I, uh, I screwed up. I forgot about the lighter. That's my bad. That's me being stupid again. Uh, yeah, so I came in that one, so it should be this one. Yeah, there it is. Okay. Ah, uh, muscle memory didn't serve me well that time. There we go. Deep dark hole, deep dark holes, deep dark holes everywhere. Feet. Did that move or was it my imagination? I don't know, James. All right, we can skip this. It's literally just him standing up. I'm trying to click on it. All right, it's just him standing up again. So, we'll grab that. One of these is rifle bullets, and I don't need it. It's that one, damn it. Okay. 
Oh, I think I need the pistol, don't I? I think I need the pistol. Because I need to get that one guy out of my way down here. I hope I remember how to get around down here. I'm also kind of worried about the hotel. It's been a while since I played this, so... You know, my memory is going to be fuzzy. Plus, I'm not doing the skips, so... I actually have to play things in the right order, which I don't always remember because of speedrunning. I'm used to doing things in a different order because I like to play around with the skips. I guess I could try the skip at the hotel, but if I screw it up, then I'm just lost in the black and won't be able to get back. So I don't know. That's probably not a, not a good idea. Although I should maybe make a save so I could practice speedrunning again. Click on it. I think it's that. I hope so, because I don't remember what the solution is. You're alive! Maria, I thought that thing killed you. Are you hurt bad? Not at all, silly. Maria? That thing, it stabbed you. There was blood everywhere. Stabbed me? What do you mean? It chased us to the elevator, and James, then- James, what are you talking about? Just before, don't you remember? James, honey, did something happen to you? After we got separated in that long hallway? Are you confusing me with someone else? <sighs> you were always so forgetful. Remember that time in the hotel? Maria? You said you took everything. But you forgot that videotape we made. I wonder if it's still there. How do you know about that? Aren't you Maria? Aren't you Maria? I'm not your Mary. So, you're Maria? I am. If you want me to be. All I want from you is an answer. It doesn't matter who I am. I'm here for you, James. See? I'm real. Don't you want to touch me? I... don't know. Come and get me. I can't do anything through these bars. Okay. Stay right there. I'll be there soon. Give me the freaking things. Hey, come on now. I clicked on that like 10 times. Oh yeah, I just realized I'm gonna have to fight the Oh, that one dude, too. Abstract Daddy or whatever. Come on. There you go. It's speed running strat. Just shoot him once with the, uh, with the pistol. Yeah. 
move. I could skip ab Abstract Daddy very easily, but I, I want to make sure we watch that scene, so I won't. Wait, is this where I go? I don't even remember. I'm in the right place. Okay. Oh, there was a newspaper there. Hold on. Let's see what it said. The body of a man, later identified as Thomas Orozco, lumberjack, age 39, was discovered in the... something. The probable cause of death was multiple stab wounds to the front of the neck and the left side of the torso by a sharp-edged weapon. The estimated time of death was somewhere between 11 p.m. and 12.30 midnight. Due to signs of struggle in the room and the lack of a murder weapon, police are considering this a homicide and have opened a murder investigation. Furthermore, given the fact that the cash in the room was untouched and Mr. Orozco had a history of drunkenness and violence, the police suspect that it that something motive was that the motive was not robbery and that this was a crime of passion hey whoa what are you doing dude i clicked on the door clearly what the hell all right there's another one right here somewhere oh okay it doesn't matter Angela, Angela's story is so fucked up in this. trying to order you so what do you want then oh i see you're trying to be nice to me right i know what you're up to it's always the same you're only after one thing no that's not true at all you don't have to lie go ahead and say it or you could just force me beat me up like he always did I don't care about yourself anyway. You're a disgusting pig. Angela. Don't touch me! You make me sick. your wife Mary was dead, right? Yes, she was ill. Liar! I know about you. You didn't want her around anymore. You probably found someone else. <sighs> That's ridiculous. All right, um, thievery. Oh, right, okay. Yeah, I gotta figure out which one it was and I don't remember who it's supposed to be on the easy one. All 
Only the sinless one can help you here. Mistakenly pulling a criminal's rope. Or whatever. I want the poem. Committed an evil crime. He turned a happy home into a pile of ash. So that's the arsonist. Alright. Okay. I wasn't 100% sure if it was the arsonist on the easiest difficulty. I couldn't remember. So it's the arsonist. Let's see. Arson. Alright. Second one over. I hope it pulled the right one. Yep. I think I got it. Wait. What? How is that not right? It said the arsonist. It did pull the right one, right? Alright, fine. Just pull all of them. I don't fucking care. Maybe it didn't pull the right one. I don't know. I'm starting to wonder if I pulled the wrong rope somehow. <clears throat> I don't know. I couldn't even get it to click on that one, so I have no idea. No, it's not the arsonist. What the fuck? How is that even possible? It literally says in the first line that it's the one that fucking burnt the house down. I don't fucking know. Alright, do this one. Do, do the first one. Ugh, God. I don't remember it. Ah, oh, fucking hell. Come on. Thank you, finally. The fuck, man? Oh wait, did I just go the wrong way? I did. I don't know how I did that. Glad we're not speedrunning this. What? What do you mean? I'm right on it. Don't be a dick. Alright, I'll skip that.
I like this scene here as you walk down the hallway and then when you get to the end it's just like completely covered in blood just so much blood all over like this it's fucking nuts You see Eddie here with just so many bodies. He's just killing everyone. okay to kill people? You need help, Eddie. Don't get a holy on me, James. This town called you too. You and me are the same. We're not like other people. Don't you know that? Let's party! Eddie? Eddie? I... I killed a... a human being. A human being. Did you really die three years ago? I need to figure out what's going on with these. That looks like like someone tried to sew like a skirt on these slabs of beef. I need to figure out what the hell these are. I need to look that up. I, I never really thought about it too much before. That's so weird. What the fuck was that? Hmm. 
Ah, shit. I went past it. My skills are a little rusty here. Man, my time across the lake is going to be really slow. That was really bad. You know, I used to hold the world record for that. It's the only world record I've held in this game for speedrunning was the boat time. I had the fastest uh, boat time for like two years, I think. Fastest time across the lake. It was like 54 seconds or something like that. Something like that. I don't remember exactly what it was, but... Uh, I need to change this because I can't remember. If I go down is where I used to go. Um, I don't think I need to do... Do I go to Laura first? I think I go in here first. Got the fish key. Did I scare you? Yeah, you did. You're here to find Mary, aren't you, James? Well, have you? No. Is that why you're here, too? She's here, isn't she? If you know where she is, tell me. I'm tired of walking. I wish I knew. But she said it in her letter. What letter? I'm gonna read it. But don't tell Rachel, okay? Who's Rachel? She was our nurse. I took it from her locker. My dearest Laura, I'm leaving this letter with Rachel to give to you after I'm gone. I'm far away now in a quiet, beautiful place. Please forgive me for not saying goodbye before I left. Be well, Laura. Don't be too hard on the sisters. And Laura, about James, I know you hate him because you think he isn't nice to me, but please give him a chance. It's true he may be a little surly sometimes, and he doesn't laugh much, but underneath he's a really sweet person. Laura, I love you like my very own daughter. If things had worked out differently, I was hoping to adopt you. Happy 8th birthday, Laura. Your friend forever, Mary. Laura, how old are you? Um, I turned 8 last week. So, Mary couldn't have died three years ago. Could, could she really be here? Is this the quiet, beautiful place she was talking about? Me and Mary talked a lot about Silent Hill. She even showed me all her pictures. She really wanted to come back. That's why I'm here. Maybe you'll get it if you see the other letter. The one, Mary. Huh? I must have dropped it. Laura. I gotta find it. Laura! <laughs> she went out the door, but it didn't look like it opened. That was crazy. Alright, I think I need to go... Uh, do I need to go upstairs, or do I need to go in here? I don't remember. Um, I know I need to grab this at some point. 
hidden in the office on the first floor. Come on then. Dude, cooperate. Two oh four. I don't need that health. Oh shit, I forgot to bring the fucking, um, the stuff to open that with. Shit, I don't remember all the words either. It's not anything with M, I, E, or P. M, I, E, P, none of those. So, let's see. Try love. Nope. Uh, well, it can't be a P at the end, so it can't be help. Uh, I don't remember any of the words. I can't remember. It can't have an E there, so it can't be over. Fuck. I don't remember. What about dull? I think dull is one of them. Yeah. Shit. Oh, and null. Nope. All right. God damn it. I was going to get it, but I was like, oh, no, I can get it later. I won't need it now. Well, apparently I needed it now. See, I told you I didn't know the order to do these things in. See what word I didn't remember. There's tons. Hell, maybe. Down. There's tons, but I, I don't remember them all. Um, Alright, that's two music boxes. Okay, yeah, I know what I gotta do now. I remember. This is the part we don't have to do when we use the glitch, so I'm not I'm just not used to doing any of this stuff. Alright, uh get on here. Okay. Wait allowance, one person. Alright. Technically, you can keep the letter, I think, and the envelope or something. You can keep, like, two things, but none of the big stuff.
Wait, damn it. See, I'm getting all confused because... Where's the key? Shit. I don't need that. There we go. I'm getting all confused because the camera went wonky and I'm not used to being in there for more than like a couple seconds. Let me skip that. I don't need to watch him open it. Find light bulbs in a can. Light bulbs in a can. Oh, dude, James. You are not listening to me at all. I gotta remember where to put the boxes. I think on easy you can just put them anywhere. I think. I don't think it matters where I put them. Dude, come on. Okay, that worked. All right. Oh, and they give me a key. Boom, 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 Bing a bing a bong. Are you taping again? Come on. Uh, I don't know why, but I just love it here. It's so peaceful. You know what I heard? This whole area used to be a sacred place. I think I can see why. It's too bad we have to leave. Please promise you'll take me again, James.
she's dead. Liar, that's a lie! No, that's not true. She... she died because she was sick? Here's the part I don't understand. Why would he tell her? her. Why would you tell an eight-year-old girl that you killed somebody? I don't remember which door goes where. Okay. That was easy enough. Spun around in a direction I was not prepared for. I don't think we need any of that stuff. Now we get our conclusion with Angela and probably my favorite scene of the entire game. Cause it's so sad but so well done and you you have it right after that you just found out what james did and that seems like so you know sad as well and i don't know it's just Mama. this game's so tragic Mama. No. 
Don't pity me. I'm not worth it. Or maybe you think you can save me. Will you love me? Take care of me? Heal all my pain? That's what I thought. James. Give me back that knife. No. I... I won't. Saving it for yourself? Maybe. This is, this is my favorite part. Ah, oh, so heartbreaking though. It's hot as hell in here. You see it, you too. See it too. For me, it's always like this. Ah. Uh. Knew that was going to happen. I was weak. That's why I needed you. I needed someone to punish me for my sins. But that's all over now. I know the truth. Now it's time to end this. I do like that it doesn't matter which one you put in which door here. Definitely saves time at the end of a run, so you don't have to try to figure out which one goes where. This conversation goes on forever. This this conversation you hear here. What do you want, James? I uh I brought you some flowers. Flowers? I don't want any damn flowers. Just go home already. Mary, what are you saying? Look, I'm disgusted. I don't deserve. 
there are flowers between the disease and the drugs. You look like a monster. Well, what are you looking at? Get the hell out of here. Leave me alone already. No use to anyone. I'll be dead soon anyway. Maybe today, maybe tomorrow. It'd be easier if they'd just kill me. But I guess the hospital is making a nice profit off me. They want to keep me alive. Are you still here? I told you to go. You deaf. Don't come back. James, wait. Please don't go. Stay with me. Don't leave me alone. I didn't mean what I said. Please, James. Tell me I'll be okay. Tell me I'm not going to die. I haven't actually sat and listened to that whole thing in a while. It's, yeah, it's hard to listen to. Come on, get up here. It always takes so long to get up the steps. You just won't run up them. James, I've been waiting. Mary. I'm sorry it took so long. Didn't you want to see me? Yes, I wanted to see you. Even an illusion of you. That's why I came here. It's not true, is it? You killed me. I couldn't watch you suffer. Don't make excuses, James. <laughs> I know it was a burden on you. You must have hated me. That's why you got rid of me. It's true. I may have had some of those feelings. It was a long three years. I was... tired. That's why you needed this... Maria person? James, do you really think I could ever forgive you for what you did? You killed Mary again? That wasn't Mary. Mary's gone. That was just something I... Maria? Maria? What, James? I want you. I want you with me. Are you sure? Come on. 
let's get out of here. <laughs> Did you see the shadow show up for a second and then disappear? That was weird. It's okay. Maybe it was this flashlight doing it? In my restless dreams, I see that town. Silent Hill. You promised you'd take me there again someday. But you never did. But you never did. Well, I'm alone there now. In our special place. Waiting for you. Waiting for you to come to see me. But you never do. And so I wait. Wrapped in my cocoon of pain and loneliness. I know I've done a terrible thing to you. Something you'll never forgive me for. I wish I could change that. But I can't. I feel so pathetic and ugly laying here. Waiting for you. Every day I stare up at the cracks in the ceiling. And all I can think about is how unfair it all is. Alright, unfortunately, I'm going to have to skip the rest of that. Um, I would love to sit and listen to it because I haven't heard it for a while but uh, it's like 2 something in the morning I need to go to bed alright let's see 115.25 we got the Maria ending 59 seconds on the boat that actually was faster than I thought it was going to be not bad I guess alright well there you go guys that is my 20th anniversary Silent Hill 2 celebration. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, tell that like button you want to smash. And don't forget to subscribe. You stay you. I'll stay me. Droogie forever. Thank you everybody so much for watching. I really appreciate it. And I'll see you in the next video. And um, if any of you can get your hands on this game, please play it. Tell Konami you want it. For the love of God, please. We need this game to live on. And its current formats, it's stuck Four generations ago on the PlayStation 2, the original Xbox. We're not counting the HD collection, so let's not speak of that. And then the PC version, very hard to get a hold of. I have a ton of copies, obviously, but it's it's hard for the average person to get a hold of them. So, you know, the greatest horror game of all time, my favorite game, period, not just horror game, game, is stuck in limbo. Um, so don't stop letting them know that you want it so that's all i ask happy birthday silent l2 see you guys